Oh, and we're back here on Smells Like 90s Rock. Uh, is now Hot Toddy and DJ Poor. Sheila's out for the evening. Uh, she's got to... You got to get Adrian to bed, but he, that's going to be a difficult task. So that's okay. What, he's got he's got more energy now. Oh, it's going to be he crazy. Yeah, Lord. He <laughs> he is he is hyperactive tonight. I tell you what. See, this is why he's I, been coming off the top rope tonight. He is. Yeah. See, this is why I, I just don't think I could deal. I I could have kids because I I don't think I'd be able to handle that. You know, I everybody always says what's different when you have your own kids. That's what I've heard. You know, it's like when so you have like your own this little yeah. you. Exactly, and, and you put up with it, but it's just like you know. I have such a, you know, I've had cats, I've, <laughs> I've had dogs, and I loved them to death. But once they start annoying me, I, I go away and <laughs> don't want you. And uh, you know, not even your dog. No, I, I'm, I'm just not a cat person. Well, I'll put I, up know, with my dog. You know, I, I love both cats and dogs. Had them off and on since I was a kid uh, up to this very point, and uh, you know, they're great to have. But you know, like. You, you you're asleep at home when they're interrupting you during your favorite show. Well, they yeah, or if, time. You're, if you're working on something very important on your computer, and all of a sudden, you know, it ju- you know, cat jumps in your lap, puts their butt right in your face, like you know, it, it's time, it's time for pettings now. It's time to put the computer away. It is now. You are now working on my clock. Thank you very much. That's why I don't have cats. They're, <laughs> they're too self-centered, See? and I'm allergic to them. Yeah. So. But you that's it. You don't know until you have your own cat. You don't know how the love you can have. It's, uh, but uh, oh, we, we probably shouldn't compare children to household pets, though. Yeah, true. But you know, it's, so many people these days are so close to their pets. You know, that it was it was like <laughs> it's like their children. It's like the couple. I work of with a lot of people. Their pets are like their kids. All right. It was like a few weeks ago when we talked about the pet peeves, and right. I, I, and one of and I didn't really mention it. I was hoping you would say it, but one of my pet peeves is, is when people dress up their animals. It's just it's a little too much. Yeah, I've Especially, never gone that far with my animals. Don't dress. I mean, well, I, I can understand a dog because a dog will put up with it. Cats don't put up with it, so don't force them to put up with it. That's I all think I'm saying. The most we ever did with my dog was, and we didn't even do it. We just went and sent him to a dog groomer one afternoon. They sent him home with like a little bandana around his neck. <laughs> Well, no, th- those are nice. Yeah, they Bandanas worked. Bandanas work for dogs. Th- yeah, those it worked work. for him. It looked good on him. But you know, I don't, I don't think he needs. May he rest in peace. Well, there you go. Oh. What he was a good it dog. Always he made it, to... on, it always ends on a sad note. He made it to fifteen. That's a good. Well, that's, that's a good, a good age. Thing. Yeah, you know, my cat made it to sixteen. She was and she, that's yeah. It's wow, crazy. that's a crazy. Yeah, that's an old old pet. She uh and she well she showed it in her last couple of years too. She like would just lay on a chair and never never get up. They uh. The moment we realized she had to be put down, she didn't even die on her own. She we had to put her down. <laughs> wow. Uh, she would she would start. I don't want to get in. So it's kind of gross. She would. Are we gonna go dark here? It's not about dark. her dying it's moments. Not, it's not dark. It's just kind of sad. She would she would regurgitate. We'll say it that way, and just kind of lay in it. It was that was when you realized. Whoa. Yeah, that's when you know. Yeah, it's probably time. It's like but, like it's okay. We'll help you. Yeah, exactly. We'll we'll <laughs> push just you suicide. towards push you towards the light. Exactly. That's. <clears throat> that was dark, though. It was that was dark. dark. It was I, I thought, yeah. I thought you were gonna talk about something, something kind of pitiful from her dying moments, and you're like, nope. She used to throw up and then lay in it. No, so we had to that, get rid and of that. That was pretty, yeah, exactly. They're like, wow, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. It that's, was, uh, it was sad. That was that's bleak. It's it's bleak. Do yeah. we have bleak music? Are we well to play tonight. <laughs> radio, to well, Radiohead's coming up next. Usually that's a little, bleak. that's a little bleak. Usually when Radiohead plays, so. They're That'll work. Nice and melancholy. They are. They're they're, they're probably a step above the your cat vomiting and then probably. Lying in it though. Well, so this probably. is probably like a happy song, whatever it, it it's is. It's happier, I guess. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's happier. It's happier, but uh, but yeah, yeah. You don't get much darker than your cat laying in its own vomit. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's. <laughs> it's uh, it Can that be? It smells sad. like '90s rock. New slow, new s- slogan. Smells like '90s rock. Happier, b- better than your cat laying in its own vomit. Yeah. I and think it's, and it's twi- in the twilight of its life. In the, in a twilight of its life, exactly. I, I can go with that. That's fine. We could do a PSA. Like, is your is your pet in the twilight of its life? Is it throwing up and then laying on it out of confusion? <laughs> well, listen to Smells Like Nineties Rock. We don't know why it's connected. Somehow it just is. All right, just go with it. Actually, there is a happy ending to that story. So she dies uh, in, <laughs> in June. In June of 2014, right? Okay. Okay. Uh, now around that. Wow, time, she made it. She made it through. The, she was born in the 90s. She, That's how old she here, was. Here, we always remember her birthday. You know why? Because she was born on my birthday, the year my sister was born. So okay. That's how we can always right. remember her birthday. She was born on April 23rd, 1998. That's how we always Aww. remember. Yeah. So yeah, she lived 16 years right up till uh, last summer. 